Purdue's football season started with a win. The Boilermakers will have their first road test coming up this weekend. But their head coach is set to return to the sidelines after recovering from a positive COVID-19 test. Brad Brown has the latest. The train got rolling in the right direction last Saturday, but Purdue head coach Jeff Brom was not where he wanted to be. So it was unique. I, I haven't really experienced that before, nor probably do I look forward to ever doing it again uh, because it just doesn't feel like uh, you're, you're a part of it a whole lot and there's not a whole lot you can do. Brom will be returning to work after a 10-day COVID quarantine. He'll come back to a team that did not play a great first game but made enough plays to get the win. We get coached all week to do things a certain way, and when you go out in the game and don't do them that way, you're frustrated with yourself. And, um, you know, I was just, you know, a few plays on the film were just hard to watch in, in terms of me not doing what I'm supposed to do. Quarterback Aiden O'Connell threw the ball 50 times, a couple of interceptions and a couple of sacks, but Purdue's offense still managed to gain more than 400 yards. I think having some balance was critical uh, to open a few things up. It's very hard to, to play against teams that are playing for the pass, and that's all you do. David Bell caught three touchdown passes on the day, among his best performances since coming to West Lafayette. He earned the Big Ten's Offensive Player of the Week honor. I've always been the type of person just to let the game come to me. I think when you try to force stuff, it tends not to go your way. So I just go with the flow. And then if Aiden, you know, decides to target me, however many times he targeted me, uh, I would just step up and be the person to beat. Bell and the rest of the Boilers are ready to put even more confidence in their junior quarterback. You can see it in his eyes that he wanted to win. And I think when, when we needed him the most uh, in those last about four minutes, you know, he stepped up tremendously. Purdue struggled against Illinois a year ago. Managed just a single late TD on a rainy day in a 24-6 loss. Solid chance they'll score a lot more this weekend. Brad Brown, WRTV Sports.